Overmuth ranks are signals, but traffic lights are the wrong association, because a traffic light is in order to do something specific. A storm warning signal like this one here is the much better association. If that signal flashes 40 times a minute, it means there is a storm coming. And for most people on the lake, it means let's go back to a safe harbor as soon as possible. <laughs> but for me, as a young sailor, it mean, meant exactly the opposite. Finally wind. I put up the sails and I went out on the lake. Obermatt ranks are just information. There are no orders. They're not even recommend, recommendation. They are just information about financial facts of a company. Let me explain to you in more detail. Good value ranks means the stock is cheap compared to the size of the company. If you believe in the future of that stock, this is a good signal to buy. But if you believe that the future is really bleak, if this company is going to have difficulties in the future, the high value rank may only be a reflection of these difficulties, and you may decide differently. If you have a company with a good safety rank, it means this company is safely financed. If you worry that the economy is going to dive, then you want the company with little debt. But it's entirely different if you believe that the future of that stock is really good. Because if you believe that this company is going to grow, you want more debt because then you have a bigger portion of that future profit for yourself. And finally, the growth ranks are only an information about the past. It says how much this stock has grown in the past. This is an information, but no prediction for the future. You may only want to use this as auxiliary information. Obermatt ranks are signals. They don't tell you what to do. You still have to decide yourself what you like to do with these signals with your investing decisions. What does that mean for me? First, Obermatt ranks are a good filter. If I pick a stock from an Obermatt top 10 list, it means it already has a good rank. And I have a better chance of future returns. Obermatt ranks are also easy. It's financial complicated information made easy to digest. But don't use the Obermatt ranks for trading. Don't use it for frequent buying and selling of stocks. Obermatt ranks are long term. And trading is often a mistake and costly. I only sell stocks when I need the money. Because I know Obermatt ranks are signals and not recommendations. <laughs>